Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm on here today with another scrapbook haul. Um, I picked up a couple of things that were still kind of missing. So um, if you have seen my last scrapbook, my collective scrapbook haul, you would have seen that I picked up um, most of the um, garden shop collection by Paige Evans. I was missing, so I'm just grabbing things here because I've kind of, kind of got them separated. So this is what I showed you in my previous video. But I was missing a couple of things, so I placed an order with um, Paper Maze. And I got another pack of the flower embellishments because they are so pretty and I am so excited to start crafting with this collection. It's so beautiful. And I also picked up one of the acetate um, sheets. The acetate from American Crafts in the UK is like £3.50. That's like four and a half dollars. Um, it's crazy. It's so expensive. But I couldn't miss out on this one because it has like copper foiling. It's so pretty. And I want this to be like on the cover of some kind of albums. Maybe I'll pick up another one because now looking at it... Um, I do kind of regret not getting another one. Um, and I also picked up the 12 by 12 paper pad. It is so pretty. Look at these colors. It's like an autumn collection, but it is so pretty. And whoops, sorry, keep bumping the tripod. Hope you can kind of see it. Um, there are some flip throughs on YouTube. So I'm just going to do like a super quick one like this. Just look at all of this. I love, I love this um, page. I've never had a 12 by 12 paper pad from Paige Evans before. So this is my first one. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, this is going to be so much fun to cut apart and then use these labels. I love how colorful everything is, but it's still kind of muted down. Um, it's not too vibrant. If that makes any sense. Oh my god do you see shakers on this page because i definitely see them so pretty and look at these autumn like leaves but the colors are like super autumnal which i really like so cute so so cute lovely cut aparts these are gonna be fun to cut apart as well everything just looks so fun love it oh my god this page is beautiful and this has a really nice um gradient here yeah such a lovely collection i was waiting for this to come in and i was finishing some other bits as well so now i can finally start crafting with it and i'm so excited and let me show you what else I picked up from Paper Maze. Um, I got some Prima flowers. Um, I'm actually missing a pack. Where are they? Oh, they're here. They're right behind me. Um, I have already started using these. They are the most beautiful flowers and I need to hunt these down. I need more packs. I don't even know what collection these are from. Um doesn't even say what year this is from i have no idea um but they're beautiful look at them i love them so much so until i can find more i will not use these i also picked up these ones you get lots of different sizes and they have glitter on the edge of these petals very pretty same with these ones and then these ones i thought would be really cool for autumn very pretty flowers. I love Prima flowers. They're so pretty. And there was a time when I was buying a lot and I was kind of trying to use them up, which I have. And now it's time to buy some more. So let me show you what I have picked up from Hey Little Magpie. Um, because I got another collection. I actually have two packages here. Let me grab everything from the other box as well. This arrived today and I had it sitting on the couch. Um, look what the cat has done. 
he has been playing with the box. So let me just take everything out of this box. There's a lot. Like I go through a lot of stuff, but I also buy a lot of stuff. Um, wow. Oh God. All right, let's start with these smaller bits first and let's look at paper um, afterwards. Actually, let me just pull all of the non-collection items away. Actually, I'm, I'm pulling the collection away and show you the non-collection items first. It's been a long day. It's Monday today and yeah, it's been a very long and stressful day. So, um, what do we have here? So, first of all, this is actually from Cheryl Simone Crafts. Um, is the name here? Yeah, right here. She had a sale in her shop and I just um, bought some more Prima flowers. She had these Christmas ones in. So these are from the new Candy Cane Elaine collection and I was so tempted to get that collection, but I have so much Christmas stuff and yeah, I can't, so I didn't. But I got the flowers because I thought they would go with a lot of things. Super pretty colors. So I got two packs. And I also could not leave this little shaker pop here. I love these doodlebug um, shakers or like 3D stickers. And it's bubble tea. How cute is this? I don't know what to do with it. I'm just going to display it because it's so adorable. But yeah, I love it. I couldn't leave it there. All right, let's move on to Hey Little Magpie. I got some bits from Rosie's studio. I got another set of these rainbow puffy stickers. I love them and I've already used one pack up. So I wanted to get another one. And then I got these glitter foam stickers from Beautiful Dreamer. It is such a beautiful shade of gold. It's like this very, very pale gold. It's stunning. And then you have this like really like yellow gold here. And you can see the difference. Like, isn't that so pretty? So these are um, word stickers from Brand New Day. I don't have any of these collections, but I thought these go with everything. And I was tempted to get this collection because it, it's like really pretty. It's like really like dark. It has cats. There's lots, you know, there's moon. Um, but yeah, I can't because I have too much stuff already. And then two other bits. I got some chipboard frames. I don't know if I showed these in a previous video. I feel like I did. I'm sorry if I did already. Um, but yeah, I got these from Sprinkled With Cheer and Hearth and Home. Just some chipboard frames that I'm going to be turning into shakers. And then I got these daisy chain dimensional embellishments. They're stickers. And I think I've already gone through three packs. But I like these so much. And I wanted to get another pack. And then Ellie Studio. I really like Ellie Studio like um, stickers. These are really fun to add to your projects. So I got the Christmas hearts and stars puffy stickers. You get so many stickers on these sheets. I can highly recommend them. And they're going to be so cute for little mini Christmas embellishments. So those will go into my Christmas stash. Then I've got the um, Puffy Heart and Star stickers. I think this is in the color scheme Warm, as is this one, I think. But yeah, very cute. And you get the um, outline and the inside heart, which is so cool. I already have one of these um, chipboard uh, stars and hearts and I've used quite a lot of them and I love that these are like really skinny chipboard. You know, that's like my kind, my kind of chipboard, but yeah, love these. And I also got the gold ones this time, puffy heart and star stickers. And yeah, it's the same layout, you get lots of them. So cool, lots of puppies, puffy stickers. All right, let's move on to the collection. And yes, I had to get it. I got Stardust by Jen Hatfield. Oh my God, this collection is so, so cute. K 
cats and pink and just pretty things and flowers and hearts all of these word stickers oh my god there isn't a single sticker in this book that i wouldn't use i normally find alphabet stickers so hard to use but there aren't any in here which is so cool and look cats pink cats oh my god so i got two sticker books one of the stickers is upside down that's funny but yeah i got two of them because all of them are on cardstock there aren't any clear stickers in here which i think is amazing and i think i will go through this really quickly because all of the stickers are quite small and yeah i find them easier to use for embellishing so i got two sticker books I also got two of the 6x12 stickers. Look at this cat. I mean, I am sad that there isn't a black and white cat in this collection, but it's okay. I can, you know, I can accept that. But yeah, there's a cat here. There's another one here and another one there. How cool is this? It kind of reminds me of a mix of She's Magic by Dear Lizzie and all heart i don't know it just um reminds me of like if you mix those two collections together you get this collection and i love it look at this flower here i just love it so much definitely will be crafting with this very soon um i got two of the ephemera packs and i love how small everything is look at it nothing is too big you get all of these postage stamps that you can rip apart and all of these labels here they're perforated as well and yeah i think everything is very usable nothing's too big nothing's too you know too plain sometimes you get a lot of journaling squares and i never know how to use them so i end up just using them behind pictures or like embellishing but yeah i'm loving these ephemera packs so i had to pick up two i also got this um there weren't any pictures of this online so i just ordered it i don't know you know just to see what it's like and i also haven't seen anyone like posting like calling this so this is a ticket like you get 35 tickets and you get these tickets and they all it's now you know it's like heavy cardstock you can take them apart because they're all perforated and then you get these ones these ones these ones i find a bit harder to use those ones again these cool tickets these ones are really cool and they have holographic foiling and yeah that's it so I just wanted to get it just to see what it's like. And it's a really cool little pack. So I got that. I got the um, epoxy stickers. They're kind of like enamel dots. And I normally don't get these because I usually find them quite expensive for what it is. But you get two sheets here, which is cool. Um, yeah, they're just tiny little epoxy stickers. And they're really small. I mean, if it was one sheet, I wouldn't have bought it. But you get two, so it's kind of worth it. And they're really cute. Did I need these? Of course not. I mean, do I need any of this, really? No. But I wanted it. Okay, we have more stickers. We have the um, foam thickers. And look at this cat. So cute. I only picked up one. Because I sometimes find these quite hard to use. So yeah, just got the one. And then I also got the dimensional stickers. I didn't even realize I got these, but apparently I did. But yeah, very cute. Obviously, cats are here. There's lots of pink. There's a pink house. They're so cute. Um, let's move on to paper. So I did get the 6x8 paper, paper pad for this collection. Um... Yeah, I, I wasn't going to get the 12x12 12 12 because this 12x12 12 12 pad was £22, which is like $25. Um, I think it's like the most expensive paper pad I've ever bought. So I was only going to buy the small one, 
But then I saw holes and I thought, okay, I think I need it. But yeah, I get holographic foiling in here. Oh my God, look how cute. So cute. I feel like this is a collection. Oh, can't wait to cut these apart. This is a collection you can use all year round. Like you don't need a specific time frame for it. Like it's not themed. So I love this. I got two of the acetate. Because look at it. It's so cute. It has holographic little stars and then some colored stars. Um, again, these are like £3.30 per sheet. But they're so cute. And they will, go, they will go with so many things. So I picked up two of those. And the super expensive 12 by 12 paper pad. You get 48 papers and they have holographic foiling, which I think is incredible. Oh, look at all those cats. Oh my God, this is so cool. And all of these color parts are cute. Like you could totally make really cool cards with this. I feel like collections by Jen Hatfield, they're very geared towards um, card making. Oh my goodness, look at this sheet. I am going to cut this entire sheet apart and have sentiments for my embellishments. How amazing is this? Wow, so cool. I'll definitely have to put on a Netflix show and cut those. Ooh, I wish I had some kind of scissors that would, you know, cut this so it looks like a ticket. That would be cool. Wow, this is really holographic. I think this would look really cool. It's like flowers. Maybe even rosettes. I think that would look really cool. Um, and then I think it just repeats, does it? Yeah, it just repeats. So you get two of each, which is great. So you don't run out of your favorite paper. But yeah, it's quite a big shopping haul because I shopped. You know, these are like four or five different orders. Because stuff was like coming in stock and then I was worried that something would sell out. So I just placed all of these orders. But yeah, super excited to play with all of this. If you want to see what I make with this, make sure you follow me on Instagram um, and subscribe to my YouTube channel to see, you know, what I come up with. Um, I don't know when I'm going to work with these collections, hopefully very soon. But yeah, just subscribe if you want to and i also have a patreon now so i post um one or two videos depending on the tier that you are interested in we have monthly giveaways there are welcome packs um there will be lives in the future and yeah so if you're interested um there's a link in my description box down below and i will see you very soon bye